Далее голодос на Пукарар. Ему 30 два года. Рост 173 сантиметра, вес 66 и 50 тонн килограмма. В профессиональный рекорд 20 побед, 5 поражений, его стиль бразильская джиу-джитсу. Ladies and gentlemen, he is 32 years old, standing 573 centimeters tall, official weight 6605 kilos. Professional record 20 victories, 5 defeats, and he is Brazilian jiu-jitsu practitioner. Ladies and gentlemen, is Baku, Azerbaijan, Tural, Rakima. Его соперник в красном углу, и за полным фарингом на Red Corner. Бойцу 28 лет, рост 175 сантиметров, вес 66,3 килограмма. Его стиль ММИ, профессиональный рекорд, 16 побед, 2 поражения. Ladies and gentlemen, he is 28 years old, standing 175 centimeters tall, of each weight, 66,3 kilos. He is MMA practitioner with press... Professional record, 16 victories and two losses. Дамы и господа, приветствуйте из Красного Россия Фотон Апти Пимбаросае. Рефери Мизинка Максим Протасов. So Maxim Protasov is the referee in charge of this bout. We are ready and steady. So we see that the fighters have. Uh, pretty equal experience, the number of professional bouts. So I think that it can it can can be a very very close and a good fight. So let's stick to the bout. Morgan Watt, Abdi Gomezayev is a little bit taller. Coming forward, nice front kick from Abdi. And a knee to the body again from Bima Zayev. Tural Ragimov tries to fight back, and a good one too from him. Oh, it was a pretty Another dangerous connection. knee to the head. And if it landed, of course, Tural Ragimov would have had he much takes more the troubles. Leg. Goes for a guillotine for a moment, but without any success. And by the way, looking at the arena, I've heard and I saw some uh, groups of fans that came here to support Surel Ragima from Azerbaijan fans. And he actually mentioned it in the interview yesterday that there will be a lot of his fans here from Azerbaijan who came here to see his fight. A big left hook, another combination from Surel. Low kick, but missed. Steve Jad from Dimon Zayev. And we see that Apti tries to use only power shots. No light shots. Maximum yes, damage. Very sharp. Oh, high kick. High kick. And you see that uh, Tural Rogima is moving to the left. So that's why Apti Dimon Zayev tries to catch him with hits that come from the right. Yeah, so that's with his strong so. right. Sure. If it's not it is a perfect game plan for Ragimov. Yes, if it is a kick or a, or a punch. Another combination from Ragimov, but perfectly blocked by Abdi Domazayev. Ragimov is a very fast guy. Sure, good hand speed. Abdi Domazayev tries to stay aggressive. Tries to push the opponent closer to the fence. And he squeezed him at the fence. Some pain moves and a nice combination. And several shots landed, by the way. What Good a counter. nice... Yeah, what a nice cut for the body. Oh, that's a karate kick, by the way, because Torel Ragimov was a karate practitioner, the European champion. So that was a classical karate kick. A wheel kick, so to say. Another crest jab from Bimer Zayev. And we also see that Aptis Bimer Zayev's hand speed is not worse than Tural's Ragimov's, and maybe even better. Yeah, but right now Bimer Zayev works a little bit more dangerous. Yeah, he looks to be more sharp, be more aggressive. Right hand by Ragimov. Nice footwork from Aptin Demerzaev and a good connection again from the Russian or from the representative of Belarus. 
But just like I told you, Abdi Bermazayev has Chechen roots, but he spent much of his life uh, in Belarus. He's the Belarusian combat sample champion. One minute and 20 seconds to go. Oh, nice connection with the left hook yeah. from Bermazayev again. Another combination by Ragimov, but misses. Ooh, nice counter with a good uppercut yeah, from by... Apti. Solid, solid striking from Apti Bimarzaev. Bimarzaev uses the distance advantage nicely. And another aspect I would like to mention, speaking about Apti Bimarzaev's strikes, is accuracy. His shots seem to be more accurate than his opponent won because if we speak about the amount, it's pretty equal. But if we say a few words about the shots that actually land, about the clean shots, so to my mind, Abti Bimazayev has a big advantage in this aspect. Another connection by Bimazayev. And look at this pressure from Abti Bimazayev, and that's for sure that Right to the chin. Ooh, good connection with the right hand. And Another he's, one. He's stunned. I think Ragimov is stunned a little bit. Crisp leg kick from Tural Ragimov, but he's hurt. He's still recovering from that damage. And end of the first round that goes under the belt of Abdi Bimarzaev, I think. Very intensive round one. And definitely goes in favor of Abdi Bimarzaev. To work more, connected more. Work first. Look at that preview. That was nasty. So the break is over, it's high time to get back into the fight. And of course, Tural Ragimov needs to do something in order to handle the striking abilities of Abtib Yomirzaev. I think that he should come forward and to be more aggressive. Okay, round two. Bimarzaev's hands are on its place. Bimarzaev with defend. the left jab. And Dragimov tries to use his left hook and right hand. But he's doing all the same, David. And so that's why Abdi Bimarzaev gets used to it. So it's easier for him to defend himself, that's for sure. So I think that uh, Turrell needs to show the variety of his arsenal. Maybe go for Bimo a takedown. Maybe yes, maybe yes, but... But Ragimov is too strong. I'm sorry, Bimurzaev is too, too strong. And look at this exchange. And Abdi Bimurzaev has found his distance, his proper distance. On, in this distance, the role Ragimov is not able to get him, but vice versa, Abdi Bimurzaev can engage, and so that is exactly what he's doing now, ruining the leading leg of Tural Ragimov with this nasty low kicks. Yes. Whoa! That Another was... attempt, but right now Ragimov was ready for it. Well, and to my mind, he was close. That Optimum Rezaev ducked down, and if he would not have done it, I think it could be it. But it never happened, so the fight resumes. Another connection by Bimarzaev, left jab. And forward he comes. Ragimov tries to use the distance, but he, work, he works at the fence. Look at him, he just steps left back. Up. Nicely done by Ragimov. But so far, to all Ragimov, before this moment, he just stepped back, having no space to move. That's because of the nice footwork from Abti Bimarzaev and the back elbow. And the first clinch of the fight, and look at this. No armbar, and Tural Ragimov is on his back, giving Bimarzaev the opportunity to attack him. So 
so attempt to extend an arm here. I think that Bimarzaev will not let that happen. And so far, Apti is on his feet, he's on top and having a better position. Now Rogimov wanted to make it a butterfly guard. And now he needs to stand up using the cage maybe, but Bimarzaev is not going to let him out. Bimarzaev is a very consistent with fundamentals. He right now uses his skills he acquired in order to control Ragimov on the ground. And right now they're in a full guard position where Ragimov holds Bimarzaev. Good connection with the right hand by Apti. Ragimov tries to separate. And the corners shout to Terrell Ragimov that he needs to stand up. And that's true. That's very true. He needs to do it. He badly needs to do it to get back on his feet. Otherwise, he will lose another round. Another connection by Bimarzaev. And we see a small cut on Tural Rogimov's forehead. That is the result of the elbow strikes from Bimarzaev. Less than a minute to go in the second. And so far, not a slight chance for Tural Rogimov to save this round. So now he just needs to defend himself and to prepare for the third and decisive round, decisive period in this fight. Or maybe he should, he should go for a submission here if he's able to. And look at these big elbows from Bimar Zayev. Yeah, several connections by Bimar Zayev. He does not want to get into the third round and he wants to make Maxim Protasov to stop the fight after this round and maybe it could be a heel hook or something like that or a leg lock no not this time so the fighters are just waiting till the time expires and so here it is and this is the end of the round and some courtesy is shown between these fighters but definitely Raul Ragimov didn't win it at all. Yeah. Well, I cannot name it like uh, 10 to 8, but 10 to 9 definitely in the favor of Apti Bimrzaev, who continues dominating in this fight. We see some a slight damage on his face, but not critical, not bad. So let's see it once again. Whoa, it was a pretty dangerous, it was a good wheel kick from Tural. Yeah, but accept it. And uh, actually, Apti Bimrzaev reacted. He yeah. saw that. He, he saw, saw that. Moment, he was but ready it was for it. so close. Yeah. But it was the second attempt. After the first one, he was ready for it. He saw it because the first one was very hard and damaging. It is a good season around round three. Okay, both fighters are ready and steady to go. The third round. It's high time Ragimov showed us something. Surprised his opponent. Nice leg kick from Tural. Right hand by Ragimov. Ooh, that was nasty. Sharp back fist from Tural Ragimov. But Apti Bermazaev continues coming forward, pressurizing the opponent. Nice defense of the hip from Apti. Well, or it could be a good counter move from Tolo Ragimov, but I think that Apti Bermazaev is just a better wrestler. Or another, another big move from Bermazaev, who just jumped on his opponent and now he's on top. In the guard position. Here, Bimarzaev tries to control. In this position, he could definitely switch off his hands. And 
Miguel for a mound. Terrell Ragimov crawls up to the fence, but Abdi Mirzaev understands that the opponent can use the cage to get up, and so he puts the opponent a, a little bit more far from the cage. But Terrell Ragimov knows what to do because he needs to stand up, otherwise he will lose the fight definitely with no doubt and no chance. Yeah, maybe he should risk more a little he bit. Needs, he needs to do it. If he wants to win. Yes, sure, but I, I think that he does. Another connection by Bimur Zaev is very consistent with his fundamental skills. Abdi Bimazayev is not going to let the opponent out of this position. He wants to maintain it. He wants to stay here. Because the time is running and the time now is working on Abdi Bimazayev. Yeah, Bimazayev does everything right. Controls his opponent. Lands some punches. Yeah, giving some big, big shots. Well, just like... We told you that they are not that hard that can yeah, knock him out. Big, but but, but just he gains points, he collects points. He's active, he's on top. And he's winning. Yes, he collects the time of control, so... And there are only two minutes for Tural Rodimov to try to save himself. Try to do something to put this fight into the other way. But... We see that Tural Ragimov is exhausted also. He's tired and he just doesn't have enough powers to respond. He had to sprawl, to, uh, to uh, beg your pardon, not to sprawl, of course, but to scramble, uh, to, to stand, stand up. up. One and a half to go. Don't see any chance for Ragimov to avoid these punches and stand up. He's exhausted, he's stunned. He ran out a lot of gas, and Bimar Zayev is still working. Yes. He's still hitting, striking the opponent with elbows, with punches. Not letting Max Protasov to interrupt him for this fight and to put them back into the stands. But here is a slight chance for Tural Ragimov to change something. But after Bimar Zayev, Takes it back. Yes, he is in control. Nice grab of the body. Vladimov tries to get on his feet. Tries to turn around, but without any success so far. But he separates and goes for a takedown right now. It's a dangerous situa situation for Vladimov. He took some punches. And still another control by Bimar Zayev. But Tural Rogimov is still in the game, but so little time for him. But we saw some kind of fights that were finished on one second, on the last second. Well, you remember the fight, the first UFC fight of Magomed Ankalaev, who was submitted on the last second of the fight. So everything can be changed and anything can happen, but not this time, I think. Yeah. And that's it. End of the fight. fight. Is over. The time expired. And of course, Abdi Bemirzaev will seal the victory today. Yeah, he did everything right. He controlled his opponent everywhere, whether it was striking or working on the ground. He made it. And it's a victory for him. So, congratulations. Look at that review. Actually, yeah. there were some moments for Tural Ragimov. Some good moments, but... Absolutely. About three or four. Absolutely. Guess, he more. had his chances. He had his moments, but he never used them. Unfortunately for him and for his team and for his fans that gathered here at Sibur Arena. Tural Rakimov is about to lose, I think. Abt 
Tim Bemanzai is the winner. A well-deserved win. Nicely done.